when solicited dreams are easily remembered, time has come for interpretation, first of each symbol separately, second in the context of the dream. Dreaming at will makes interpretation much easier because we know in advance what the dream is talking about. It is simply the subject addressed in the question. More than 90% of dreams communicate information through symbols. The remaining 10% or less is literal. Generally speaking, symbols are understood through their definitions. Let us look at a few examples and some of their descriptions. Flying birds signify an overall view or instructions of a higher order or what we aspire to and also the soul. An open window represents opening up to a larger vision. A dish brush is suggesting to clean up one's act. A bell is a warning signal. Children imply innocence, beginnings, continuity, the past or past lives, immaturity, hopes, and more. They have so many meanings, no wonder they are so important to us. An island stands for taking distance, isolations, independence. Drawings show how we look or should look at a situation and a need for self-expression. A language foreign to us shows a lack of understanding and a game perhaps how we play games. There are many good dictionaries of dream symbols. To consult them speeds up dream work and often validates our own understanding of the images. Some have made their way online. Dictionaries can also trigger curiosity to further investigate an interpretation they propose. For instance, according to some dictionaries, rectangles are supposed to stand for experience in a certain domain. There is no logic to justify this statement, but you can always take an opinion for granted and ask in a subsequent dream to confirm this meaning. Quite often, entries are missing. You are left to your own means. No dictionary I possess has an entry for the teal color. After questioning my dream mind, I figured out that teal portrayed survival or compensation. Entries may have additional explanations not found in dictionaries. I read many descriptions for strawberries but none of them made sense in relation to my question. In fact, strawberries also designate the uterus and the heart because of their shapes. But how does a dream deliver this kind of information in reality? Here is an example. On a scale of 0 to 5, does milk signify the relationship to our motherland? I was wondering whether this definition could be added to the meanings found in my dictionaries. It felt like a natural extension of their descriptions. In the dream, I am filing the five nails of my left hand. I understand that, yes, I should list this explanation, I guess, with the others. It is a totally accurate interpretation as expressed by the five fingers which stand for the scale number. Indeed, milk represents the feminine in its material form, the motherland, symbolized traditionally by the left side of the body. Occasionally, you might have to tell your higher self to show how a concept would manifest in dreams. Let us see. 
I want to see a representation of homosexuality in dreams. Here is the image which came up. The focus was on the metal plates at each end of the shoe sole. I concluded that homosexuality is about focusing on one sole aspect of the yin or the yang opposite poles in order to protect the soul, S-O-U-L, of the individual and strengthen it. Dreams often contain puns and slang or use a particular vocabulary to make their point. Nail polish might bring the attention to the country of Poland and milk to the fact that someone is milking you. Always look at the name or initials of individuals who appear in your dreams to see if they have a meaning, like MD for Michael Douglas. If you want to know the role of a person in your dreams, describe his or her personality, profession and life events. Then find the relation to the question. People generally represent an aspect of yourself, like obedience to the law. Sometimes they refer to a past life, perhaps as a nun. Some other time they portray a situation to handle, such as obesity. People can also point at a knowledge to acquire, possibly analytical skills, or at a behavior to develop, let us say, competition and more aggressiveness. Because of the limits of dictionaries and to facilitate dream interpretation, it is recommended to write your own dictionary. It is particularly necessary when symbols are highly personal. For example, anything French or France, my country of origin and of my last life, refer in my own dreams to the past in general or to specific events in my youth or in my previous incarnation. The color black is one of the most important symbols to understand because of its function and frequent presence. Black stands for the shadow world, that is what is not in the light yet, what we need to discover in order to grow. Black might express the unknown, the unconscious, the unmanifested. In addition, black depicts negativity such as the lack of alignment, the wrong path, destruction. Black is also the color of disconnection as in loneliness, of death, real, or portraying the end of a phase. Sometimes black means at night or in mental darkness, or simply that there is nothing to worry about. In its most glorious form, black represents also potentials ready to be activated for the purpose of creativity. To sum it up, Dream symbols are understood through definitions, dictionaries and websites, personal interpretation inspired by the context and the question. Symbols can also be figured out by consulting dreams for explanations or looking for puns, slang and idioms.